Yo, 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 yo. What's up, guys? NJ Bike. Wait, I'm not NJ Bike Life anymore. What's up, guys? Dorian here. And uh, today I'm out in the Crown Vic, as you can tell. It's a nice rainy day. It's going to be raining for the next five days here in New Jersey. Seems like every time I make a video, it's raining. So please don't mind it. It's just the best days to get out for a drive or when it's raining because you can slide all over the place and have a little bit of fun in these cars. So that's when I tend to drive. Um, probably be doing a lot more videos coming up just because I might be buying another Crown Vic. So this Crown Vic is a 2006 Crown Vic Police Interceptor, 152,000 miles, just had the transmission rebuilt, just had a whole bunch of work done. But I found another 2006 Crown Vic with 71,000 miles in Brooklyn, Brooklyn, New York. And it has um, the ABS light on and the airbag light on. Now those two lights I don't really care about. I can still get my car inspected with both of those lights on, so it doesn't really matter to me. I just, I kind of want that car just to have like a backup car in case this car starts uh, going bad. If the engine goes or something like that, at least I'll have a car with 71,000 miles and you you can't really beat that. So I, uh, yeah, I might be getting another Crown Vic, but we'll see how that goes. Like I said, it's, been, it's gonna be raining here in the next five days. So I really have to like sit down and think of a day that I can go look at it because I don't really want to look at it in the rain just in case it has damage I won't be able to see any of the damage let's see if this car will go because they have the right of way yep perfect good job you listened well so yeah I don't know if I'll actually go and get that car but I'm definitely interested in it and for the fact that it's a 2006 and it, I could use it for a lot of parts it's kind of driving me in order to to start looking into it and actually wanting it but uh, yeah, I wanted to take the time to let you guys know what my plans were for the future if I were to get another Crown Vic. It's not a, uh, the Crown Vic's a police interceptor, but it doesn't have the spotlight and it has the chrome grill, so it's more like the street appearance package Crown Vic. But it's still, it's still a really clean Crown Vic on the inside. The outside looked pretty good, but the pictures weren't the best, so I can't really tell you. Uh, another thing I wanted to, to, to shout out was on Facebook there's this group called Crown Victoria P71 it's probably the best group on Facebook uh, when it comes to anything to do with Crown Vicks there's so many different type of Crown Vic owners there's so many people that can help you and actually want to help you so I just want to give a shout out to everybody on the Crown Vic page on Facebook I really appreciate all the help that you've given me I really appreciate all the advice all the the heads up uh, it's very, it's, it's very cool to have a group like that that actually cares and actually wants to help people. That's not just, you know, ignorant and and just talking down to people, trying new projects and doing new things. It's it's a very, it's a very productive group. Um, I also want to give a shout out to to Chris from that group. He always goes above and beyond to make comments and and form solid opinions on the. The better hood i should say of of crown vix and of the group he does a lot of videos where he gives very very detailed information about crown vix and the auctions in delaware and how to go about actually buying a car this car is flying so shout out to chris for that i, I always appreciate seeing his videos they're they're really really good videos uh, I also want to shout out Notorious CVPI for recently totaling his Crown Vic, but hopefully in due time he'll be getting another one. Uh, he was kind of the reason that pushed me to get the push bar for this car, because his his white Crown Vic looks so sick with it on the front. He has the Satina, I got the Go Rhino, but I like the Go Rhino the best out of all the push bars. I don't care what anyone says. So he, he definitely pushed me to get a push bar. It looked really good on his car. So I got his car. Uh, I got the push bar because of him. And his car recently got totaled. So I hope he gets another Crown Vic. He said he was looking into a 2011 black Crown Vic. So hopefully he ends up getting that for a good price and with no issues. And uh, sorry to hear about your car getting totaled, man. That, that really sucks. Uh, so check him out. Be sure to check him out on YouTube. Uh, 
this is gonna pretty much be a shout out video for people on YouTube, so um, East Coast Classic, look at that Crown Vic right there. That's definitely a cop car though. Street appearance package. Um, definitely check out East Coast Classics. That's Chris's channel. It's a pretty sweet channel. Like I said, he does a lot of auctions where you can see the actual real-time buying and real-time um, prices and stuff like that of, of Crown Vicks so you can get a price of what they should be going for in your neighborhood. Uh, shout out to Notorious CVPI. He does a lot of Crown Vic videos, but just totaled his. But definitely shout out to him because he makes he makes a handful of really, really good videos. And he does a lot of drive drive throughs like this. Um, also be sure to check out Mr. Random Reviews. I'm sure you guys already know him if you're interested in Crown Vic videos. Mr. Notorious Reviews, or Mr. Random Reviews, does videos on how to modify your Crown Vic. He does a lot of Florida Crown Vic. Like, he was from Florida, but he just recently moved. But he does a lot of uh, videos from around Florida area, and he has a really nice, uh, clean, blacked out Crown Vic with a full wraparound bar. So, definitely give him a, a, a subscribe, a view, because of just the amount of content he has. He has so much content that other people really don't have. And it, it, it's a very unique channel. And he's very informative. He's down to earth. Used to be a K9 cop. So, yeah, definitely give his channel a, a shout. This person is just chilling under a tree. No big deal. So, yeah, Mr. Random Reviews, Notorious CBPI, East Coast Classics with Chris. Um, WJ Handy Dad, if you guys don't know him, you live under a rock because he makes like every single fix video for for Crown Vicks. Uh, it's another Crown Vic. I've been I've been actually watching Miami Police Department and uh, Mike Mo Police Vlogs, Mike Mike something Police Vlogs. Those two channels actually do like police vlogs where they'll go out in their cruisers and they'll they'll do vlogs of their of their day-to-day -day basis as a cop and stuff like that. And I've been recently watching those because I thought those were, were really cool. This is a good spot to do donuts if you ever wanted to do some donuts out here in Ramtown, New Jersey. Definitely come out here and rip a fat donut or two. Um Yeah, so I would definitely check out those those couple channels. I'm gonna get behind this car just to just to be a jerk. Why not? Got nothing else going on. So yeah, check out those couple channels. Be sure to drop a subscribe, drop a like, let them know I sent you. And uh, yeah, if you like my videos, let me know what I can improve on. Let me know what kind of views you would like. Now that you see I have the forward facing view uh, from right here, I can have it face me if that's cool. I could also do, um, you know, on my head. I could, I could pretty much do it all. So just let me know what, what view you guys like best and, and I'll try to accommodate them. And then, uh, if any other content you guys want to see with the Crown Vic, or if there's anything that you have in mind, just let me know. I'll uh, be sure to add it. I got, I'm all open for ideas. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna be ending this video. I'll do a, a smoky little burnout. Didn't even burn out. I got winter tires. I have the Eagle RSAs on the back, so it's like really hard to spin these tires because they're extremely soft. But what are you gonna do? It can't rain all the time, you know? Alright guys, see ya.